Hey everybody, this is Joanne from Texas coming to you from outside. We were supposed to get just a light dusting of snow where we could still go out to eat tonight. Just a dusting. Yeah, no, it's not a dusting. It's not a dusting. I don't know if y'all can see that. I hope you can. Mm -mm. No, it's about two inches. And it's about, um, I don't know, I think they said it was like seven degrees or lower than that. I think it's lower. Anyway, I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's covered. Everything's covered, and it is so cold out here. I mean, they're calling school <clears throat> schools off during the day, which they normally don't do that, and they haven't in Garland. So my little chicks are not all home, and uh, that drives me crazy that they're not because my son's leaving work early, so he's on his way home, and um, my daughter-in-law's home. Uh, my daughter is still teaching. She's a teacher, and they haven't let school out. And uh, the snow is just now beginning to stop, and it's been going on since about, I don't know, 7 o'clock this morning. And right now it's uh, 1.30. They said at about 2 it would be over. Anyway, uh, needless to say, I mean, my husband has been out in it and actually said that he hopes that it's the uh, dinner is called off for tonight because an accident happened right in front of them. People in Texas don't know how to drive in snow. That's all there is to it. But since the temperature so is so low, it is freezing. And there, I mean, if you're on ice, it's it's just the worst. So I'm gonna put it outside the window so you can see. Anyway, it's not much for y'all that get like, you know, 20 inches or whatever. But it's a lot for Texas to get nearly 3 inches. So, anyway, on to HCG. I am down a pound today. Whoa. Whoa, what? I'm down a pound. I am at 21.8 pounds in 40 days. Excited. That puts me at, are you ready? 191.6 eek so happy about that uh let's see last night yesterday <clears throat> i went and got my daughter's bathing suits not gonna be able to give her to her now uh until i see her next time um uh, but i had a, uh, an apple and i had a quest bar I was going to come home and uh, fix a salad, but to tell you the truth, uh, I came home and because I had ate that apple on the way home, I really wasn't hungry. So uh, probably about, um, I can't remember, it was after I'd been home for about an hour, hour and a half, I started getting a little hungry. So I ate a Quest Bar because I wasn't hungry enough for a full meal. So anyway, I did that. And then last night I had my chicken and I had um, cucumber, onion, and bell pepper salad with um, a touch of balsamic. And I steamed it uh, in with my chicken and it was really good, really good. So I'm going to have, uh, and then uh, for lunch which I forgot to get a picture of, so I can't post it on the Facebook page. Uh, I had um, fajita with uh, beef, thinly sliced beef, and a little bit of onion and a little bit of bell pepper. I'm trying to get rid of my bell pepper. And uh, I had it over a, a small salad, and then and I had hot sauce over that, so that was really good. Uh, and I've had probably about two glasses of water. I need to step it up on my water, but it is so cold here. I might have to start drinking hot tea or something. Anyway, um, 
I guess that's it. I've got nothing else. Everything's going good. I feel good. Um, I want, I probably, I wanted to make it into the 170s. You know, that was my original plan. But it might take me another 30 days to do that. And I can't, I don't think I can, can go that long. So uh, once I get into the 180s, I'm going to reevaluate and see how I feel. And uh, if I feel like I need to, then I'll go into uh, phase three. Uh, once I get into the 180s and then just start again in uh, about three weeks until I uh, reach um, whatever I reach because who knows I thought I would be be able to reach the 170s on this round and uh, I haven't so um, you know that's just it you just never know what you're going to do because I was releasing like crazy in the beginning like that and I thought no problem you know I'm going to be able to reach the 170s well no so uh, plans change so um, I will like I said uh, reevaluate I would like to get to the to the lower 180s I can uh, like I said I'm on day uh, 39 today it's 40 but 39 uh, I think I can go a little longer. I'm, I'm still feeling good. Uh, I think I can go at least another 10 days. And uh, so hopefully within another 10 days I'll be able to get into maybe the mid-180s. And then just uh, do a really, really good, really uh, strict P3. And um, not even do a P4 and then go back into it. So anyway, that's the plan maybe. I really don't have a plan. I'm just kind of winging it here. Anyway, just so long as I, it was what I want to do is I want to get into my end goal is like probably in the 150s by July because that's when we're going to the Dominican Republic. So, uh, anyway, I, I didn't reach my goal last July. I wanted to make it to... 200 and I think I made it to 220 so um, or 219 or no 218 so I was close but uh, you know and I was fine with that I was fine with that I didn't sweat on the plane the year before at my heaviest weight I had swelled so bad on the plane and that was my main thing, was not to swell on the plane, and I didn't. I was so proud of that. That was a non-scale victory. And I fit in the airplane seat with room to spare. That was another non-scale victory. Ugh, I was just, like, thrilled. Just thrilled. Anyway, I'm going to go. This is long enough, and I will see y'all tomorrow. And uh, I'll probably be back in tomorrow because this will probably all freeze tonight and I'm not getting out in the ice so yeah everybody stay warm and nice and cozy and I think uh, Peggy in Amarillo which is about 350 miles from me I think is, is getting it uh, worse than we are so anyway uh, stay safe everybody else stay nice and cozy and I will talk to y'all tomorrow bye